So it's been 16 days since we started cycling the set, the cycling the tank. Um, and my nitrites, I believe, are probably actually over 5 ppm. And the instructions on the Dr. Tim's Fishless Cycle website say they should do a partial water change if it is higher. So I'm going to do a 50% water change. So this tank is about 224 liters for the display and about 97 for the sump. So I'm going to go 300 equals I'm going to do a 150 liter water change. I'm going to have to find out a better way to do this. Um, I'm going to try and measure out buckets. So whatever, this, these are 9 liter buckets. So maybe how many times 150 fits into this. Um, that's how many buckets that I'm going to work out as 50% and then I might just mark it off somewhere near the back of the tank or something so I know what level to refer to if I want to do another 50% water change. Um, so yeah, let's see how this goes. I've now done a 50% water change, which actually may have been a little bit more than 50% just because I didn't account for the rocks and the sand, but there's not that much in there. Um, but yeah, I just did like 16 and a bit buckets of 9 litre buckets to get about 150 litres, which is about half the water volume of this uh, setup. Uh, so as you can see, my ammonia has definitely come back to the sort of 0 ppm range, so it must have been just sitting at the 0.25. Um, and I'll put up some photos, but my nitrates are still pretty high, but I think they've come down to about the 2 ppm range. Um, whereas earlier they are actually much darker, so they probably would have been way over, possibly above 5. And my nitrates have come down from about 10 ppm, probably to that 5 ppm amount. So yeah, we'll uh, see what the cycle shows tomorrow. And I guess the plan is from here, once the nitrites are gone, I'm going to add another 2 ppm of ammonia uh, just to keep feeding and building up the bacteria. Because uh, the idea is your tank is only truly fully cycled when you can add like 2 ppm of ammonia and then overnight, that should be completely gone. That's when you know that your tank's really ready to actually like have fish. Because so I think a lot of people have like mini cycles that kind of happen when they just wait for the ammonia and nitrites to disappear, and then they go and add fish because they're all gone. But then your actual sort of bacteria um, isn't capable of handling actually having fish which are constantly outputting ammonia when they breathe and eat and poop. Um, whereas when they were cycling, it was just like an ammonia source that for the most part, um, unless you have a lot of like live rock that might have die off that slowly releases it, for the most part, um, it's sort of a single source of ammonia that kind of runs out. So anyway, we'll see what the results are like tomorrow.